Hi, my name is Ramps Killian and welcome to this video. Let's have a conversation about TikTok and corn. Now, most of you know, and if you've been on TikTok for a while, you probably experienced the um, scantily clad ladies and gentlemen on the app who are tantalizing you with uh, their bits. And uh, that's where it was most likely and always stayed as, as everyone just borderline revealing everything on their body for them views. And no one complained. Well, people knew about it, and people were like, oh, there are kids on this app. Yeah, but that's fine. That Kids will probably see this shit anyway if they have Google, they have their phone. If they're unsupervised on a, on a mobile device or a computer, they're going to see porn. It happens. You've seen it that way. I've seen it that way. We've all done it that way. Don't be acting all, all holy and mama, mama mia now. Not that I'm promoting the fact that kids should watch porn. Let me just clarify that right now. I'm not doing that, okay? But, so, there's this new trend going on on TikTok, and I'm going to try to... It's working now. Sorry, my left ear isn't giving audio. Now it's finally doing working. So, there's a new trend on TikTok where they'll upload it. If you don't know, you can upload still images to TikTok and then let play music over it, and then just, like, swipe, swipe. Like an Instagram story, basically. But this is thing which people probably figured out is if you upload multiple images of the same image, the censoring, the, the whole security check from TikTok fails. So what people have been doing is using this one sound from Dragon Ball Z where Kakarot or whatever his name, Vegeta, talks about giving up trying to be like Vegeta. I don't know fucking Dragon Ball anymore. It's changed too much for me. I, I don't get it. Anyway, that's not the point. The point being is they upload a lot of images of like... Same person, same girl, 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 tits, girl, 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 girl. That's the only way I can explain it. And, and people are like, oh, this is a new trend. And the, the, this is like, I saw it once today on my For You page. I think like yesterday night or morning I saw it on my For You page. I was like, holy shit, this is going to get removed. I've had approximately five or up to ten videos of the similar style recommended to me on my For You page and none of these have been removed. They've been up for a, most likely a day or two. This is a brand new thing. And also these are all bot accounts. Like these are new accounts made specifically to farm likes and account likes because you know that's scary though. I don't know what the implications the implications of that is, like, what are they going to do with all those likes? What are they going to do with all those follows? What are they going to do? What are they going to do? And basically, there's a shit ton of these videos going on TikTok. And TikTok seemingly isn't doing anything about it. Because if you were to post anything horrific on TikTok, they usually snap fast. <laughs> TikTok is renowned for their quick censorship on their platform. They're really good. Sometimes. Not all the time. Sometimes. Better than other platforms, let's put it that way. And TikTok is sleeping on this. And I've seen so many different... And the thing is, sometimes you're a little bit concerned because some of these girls on the videos, you really can't tell if they're over 18. Because they're lo like, young. They're looking really young. And you're like, oh shit, this, 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 this shouldn't be. And also, like, think about the kids. Like, you know, seeing a girl in a bikini is like, for a boy of like 16, 17, an amazing thing. You're like... Are hormones. But, you know, if you're getting videos where you're like, swipe, 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 boobs! Swipe, 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 meow, meow. Then I should probably not be shouting boobs that loud because my window's open. <laughs> it, it, it's scary. Like, so everyone is on, on the comments of these videos are like, oh, TikTok is becoming Twitter now. But here comes a cool part. A little update to TikTok, actually. Um, creators can now age gate their content or specifically their live streams, or I think also content also, so far as I understood, so that you could say only up to 16, only up to 18 people can watch my content. Is this TikTok open the door for adult content on their platform? Did they basically look at the desert, the, the empty field that it was Tumblr and be like, we can do that better. We, we can do this much, 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 much better. Is there going to be a red tube version of um, of TikTok? These are all questions I'm ans asking towards you guys. Because what do you think? Do you think this should be a thing? Should there be a platform? No, let me rephrase the question. Should TikTok 
and YouTube and also Twitch allow adult content but have it on a separate side of the website. I have a colleague called Andy Does Voiceovers. He has suggested that that should be a thing to solve the issue of, you know, bikini streamers and all these clickbait female male content creators. And uh, I, I don't personally, I don't know. Personally, I don't think it's a good idea. I think the app TikTok should not, <laughs> should not also involve porn because TikTok on itself is a super addictive platform. I have my, I myself have to turn, I, I turn off my phone before I go to bed because otherwise I'm going to be on TikTok for way too long and I don't get any sleep then. And I need my beauty sleep. I really do need my beauty sleep. If you were to combine the addictiveness of TikTok's algorithm and how it works with porn, whoa, whoa, that's bad for a whole generation of kids. And I really just, I'm, I, I'm like, I'm not trying to harp on the whole idea of like, think about the kids, but I'm seriously saying, think about the kids, the implications of what this will do to the kids. And also, is this good for the platform's legitimacy? But then again, this isn't really being uh, allowed by TikTok. This is a bug. This is a trick of the system to upload the pornographic images. Uh, so really, we can't fold TikTok too much. Not too much. But then again, it's also the community allowing this to happen because the community are like, oh, this is awesome. I'm going to like it. Because those videos don't have like a 50 likes or 20 likes. No, 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 no. Those bitches have like up to 500,000, 100, 200,000 likes. They have so many likes. And I don't want to even know about how many favorites they got. And this is a trend that's picking up more steam. See, like if you are on TikTok, you've probably accidentally seen one of these videos. You probably didn't scroll through all the images because you're like, I don't want to see images. I don't, I'm here for TikTok form, video form. I'm here for video form. But if you see images and hear a certain Dragon Ball voiceover from Vegeta, be advised, you're going to see some genitalia. Uh, much more I cannot tell you about this, and there's not much more I can add to this. Otherwise, I'm just going to drag it out for 10 minutes, which I don't really want to do, basically. All I want to say is huge thank you for everyone supporting me on the channel recently with the streams and now with the video uploads, liking the video, subscribing, and so forth. Thank you very much for doing so. Um, we're very close to getting 720. Let's get to 720 uh, so we can get to 720p. And then we're going to 1080p. And let's get to 1,000 subs by the end of the year. Uh, is that a possibility? Okay. If you don't like the video, dislike it. If you liked it, liked it. If you like more of this content, subscribe to it. And comment down below what you think about TikTok's pornographic history and future. And if you think it's a bad thing or a good thing for the business. Who cares? Anyway, I stream on Friday, Saturday uh, from 8.30pm to midnight BST. Uh, that's pretty short of time. And I play games like Fox Hall recently. I'm addicted to that game. And also a few single player games like Shadow of War. Come check me out there. Tell me what you think about all this thing. I love your face with a bit of pun. I'll catch you boys and girls in the next video. So take care and goodbye.